one in the American. Golden Hurricane was idle last week and back in action Thursday at uh, 8 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Central on ESPN. I think we'll wait a bit to get Coach Montgomery on the line here. Here with us just a moment. Mm-hmm. And do we have Coach Montgomery? Yes. Coach, great. Thanks so much for joining us. Uh, just, I know coming off uh, an idle week, uh, can we get your thoughts on the upcoming uh, Thursday night matchup against Houston on ESPN, please? Yeah, obviously we got an extremely tough opponent. I mean, uh, uh, they're doing a great job offensively and defensively, especially, you know, led by Ed Oliver. I mean, uh, one of the top guys in the nation, guy that you have to account for. Uh, everything, in my opinion, kind of revolves off of him and and uh, you got to account for him. I don't know that anybody has come up with the right answers for him yet, uh, but you know you got to uh, know where he's at and know what he's doing uh, every snap. Offensively, they're playing with great tempo, throwing the ball down the field, being very explosive, and and so uh, we know we've got a tough test this week, especially going down there. Uh, Houston's always a tough place to play, and when you do it on a Thursday night, it adds a little bit more to it. So. Uh, we're excited about the opportunity and, and looking forward to the challenge. Any questions for Coach Montgomery, please? Star 1 on your telephone keypad to join the queue, then the operator will introduce you. Which I'll throw the first one out, actually the same one that I that I asked uh, Coach Scotty Montgomery earlier. Um, you, your team has seen uh, drastic improvements on defense from, from last year to this year, uh, about 180 yards better per game than, than it was and several points uh, you know, better than at this time. Uh, was there anything specific that you can point to just for the uh, for the for the um, the delta there and, and the turnaround and, and those numbers and, and the performance of your defense so far was a real relative strength to your team? Yeah, you know, I, you know, we changed some things schematically, but I think more than anything, we got some guys back. I mean, we had so many injuries last year, especially on the defensive side of the football, and. We gained some valuable experience, but, uh, you know, having those guys coming back with the experience we gained from our younger players, those guys have been able to step in and play extremely well. Uh, We've done a good job in early downs of trying to get teams behind the chains and being able to to get off the field on third down. Uh, We've limited some of those explosive plays, obviously, this week with the explosive offense that we're facing. It's going to be a great challenge for our defense, but we're tackling better. I think we're understanding schematically where we fit and what we do, and those guys are, are doing a good job of playing together and communicating and, and making things happen. Along those lines, are, they, are there any individuals you can point to that have, that have really made the type of improvement that you were looking for uh, from last year to this year? Well, I mean, we've, we've still got some young guys playing, but it's great to, you know, McKinley Whitfield has always been a, an outstanding player for us, and he's continuing that process. It's good to have Manny back, but I think our corners are, are playing really well right now. Uh, up front, uh, Travis Gibson has done a great job for us uh, playing either the end or the four-eye part. Um, we've had some guys kind of step up in that. We've done a better job uh, against the run, and uh, a lot of that deals with uh, you know our, our front-line guys doing a great job at the line of scrimmage. Thank you for that answer. Do we have any other questions for Coach Montgomery, please? Star 1 on your telephone keypad, if so. Coach, thanks for giving us a few minutes this week. We look forward to talking to you again next Monday.